We get asked very often whether there are age limits related to limb lengthening. I think it's important to separate the lengthening we do for limb equalization and deformity correction from stature lengthening. For limb equalization and deformity correction, there are no real limits in terms of age because that is a treatment that solves a specific problem for the patient at that time in their life and we can deploy these techniques relatively safely in that context. When we're dealing with stature lengthening surgery, there are very discrete age limits and the reason for that is safety. Now, of course, height dysphoria or a um, height neurosis, if you want to use that term, uh, can exist at any age in a patient. So we do not limit the psychological impact of the uh, short stature on the patients by age, but the surgery itself is at, at its safest somewhere between 20 and 40 years of age. So we can bring the age down to probably 18 years at the lowest end and we can probably extend it to about 45 years at the upper end, but that is roughly the safe range for stature lengthening surgery. We need to take into consideration that the older the patient gets, the slower the bone growth will be and also the nerves and the muscles might not respond so readily to the stretching that we place across the limb. At the lower end of the range, the body will respond very well to lengthening uh, in a 17 or an 18 year old, but we also have to take into consideration that the patient might not have finished growing and also on top of that, that the psychological resilience of the patient might not yet be where it needs to be for a complex process like this. So the safe range for stature lengthening uh, in most patients is from the age of 20 to roughly the age of 40. And within that range, it remains a relatively safe procedure to increase the patient's stature and change their life.